Good afternoon. In this video, which is video three of our mower deck cell setup, we are going to set up the simulation programs in order to allow us to pick up the mower deck and the different assemblies that go on the actual mower deck for the assembly and then place it onto the conveyor belt. So all the simulations that we need is we need to have the deck to move down. We also need to have the deck be picked up put onto our jig, then each one of these blade assemblies need to be picked up and then placed onto the jig, and then the finished mower deck assembly needs to be picked up and then placed onto the conveyor bed over here. So this is what we're going to set up for the simulations and for this video. So let's go to teach, add simulation program, and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go the raw mower deck pickup, so I'm going to turn on my caps lock and I'm going to go. So raw mower deck pickup. And this is where we're going to pick up. So we're going to pick up. What are we going to pick up? We're going to pick up the mower deck. So that's the original mower deck. We're going to pick it up from the conveyor start pallet. So that's our starting pallet. And we're going to grip it with the EOT suction grip. So it automatically knows which one we're going to pick up because we already set this up in the previous video. So let's go to now instruction. We're going to do a little wait. So I like to wait about a half of a second to allow it to pick up properly. So now that we have the raw mower deck pickup set up, let's close that out and let's create the placement. So let's go to teach and we're going to add simulation and this is going to be our raw mower deck drop off. So we have our raw mower deck drop off. Hit OK. And just like before, we're going to add instructions. We're going to do a drop. And we are going to drop the mower deck. And because we have this all set up from the previous video, it knows exactly where we're going to be placing this. So you're going to do EOT suction onto the mower deck jig. And let's wait that half of a second. And let's close out of that. So now that we have this place, now we need to have each one of these blade assemblies to be dropped off. So I'm going to go teach, add simulation program, and this is going to be blade housing. This is what holds the bearing and also the pulley. And we're going to just do pick up. And we go pick up one. And we actually copy this so I don't have to continuously type in blade housing pickup, blade housing pickup, because we're going to have three different areas. So blade housing pickup, hit OK. And here we're going to pick up. And we're going to pick up blade assembly number one. And it's going to be from the conveyor belt. And we're going to be using the gripper. Okay, wait the half second. There we go. Let's close that out and add another program, add simulation program. Control V will paste, and this will be blade housing pickup number two. Hit OK. And we're going to just do the pickup again. And we are picking up assembly number two, conveyor, and with the gripper, wait half second. And make sure this is the half second. Close that out, and then we're going to teach, add simulation program, and this is going to be number three. And we're going to pick up blade assembly number three. Everything is good, and we're going to wait that half second. There we go. Now we have all these picked up. Now we have to place them in the correct areas. So we're not looking at physical position yet we're just adding the this is where we're going to place so we're going to go to teach add simulation program and this time we're going to switch this to drop off drop off and I'm going to copy this so this is going to be drop off one hit OK and we're going to add the instruction drop and this is going to be drop blade assembly number one from the gripper onto the mower deck jig so that's all good we're going to wait our half second, and that's all good. Let's keep doing that. Add simulation program, and this is going to be number two. We're going to drop. We're going to drop assembly number two onto the mower jig. Half second. Close that out. 
teach, add simulation program, and this is going to be number three. There we go. So we have the blade assembly number three. So now we have our drop off point for this. Next, we're going to have the finish mower deck onto the actual conveyor belt. So let's add a new simulation program. Let's call it finished mower deck. And this is going to be the pickup. So we're going to do the pickup first. So I'm going to copy this first part here so I don't have to type it again. Hit OK. And we are going to do a pickup. And we are going to pick up the finish deck assembly from the mower jig with the suction. We're going to wait that half second. Close that out. And then we need to drop it off. So let's go teach, add simulation program, paste. And this is going to be drop off. Hit OK. And we are going to now drop this. We're going to drop the finish deck onto the conveyor with the suction. So those all match because we have everything set up from the previous video. Half second, there we go. So now we have all our simulations. So this is the pickup and placement. So this is where if you have an actual device, this is where you have the sensors. So because we don't have the sensors and everything hooked up, digital in, digital outs, on the actual end of arm tooling, this is the robo guide. So that means we have to add simulations to actually pick it up and place it. In real life, you would have just a digital in, digital out, or robot in, robot out, some sort of sensor sensing that, hey, I have a grip on this, let's go. So that's the difference between real life and then the simulation program. So that's all the simulation programs that we're going to be utilizing. You can also add simulation program for the on light and off light. We're not going to do that in this cell with this scenario. So the next video, we're going to set up the tool rack so that we are able to grab a tool and then place a tool.